Hello everybody, good morning, good morning, good morning everyone. I hope that you're all having a blessed day so far, so far, so far. I have been listening to the song, um, well, it seems like sister is already jumping into because I'm too excited. Yes, if this is your first time, my name is Gloria Vilika Mbe and I welcome you to Living Victoriously with Glow. I just have a short Two minutes message for you, my dear sister. Huh? Um, I've been listening to the song by uh, Evangelist Nathaniel Bassi that says, See what the Lord has done. And it made me think about the journey that I've um, that I've had with God, the journey that I've had with the Most High God, His faithfulness, His grateful. Please don't mind the newspaper on my table there. <laughs> yes. Um, it reminded me of the goodness of God, His mercy, His favor, His grace upon my life. You know, when you know when you think about the things that God has done in your life, you will understand when the Bible tells us that um, He's our shepherd that we should not want. And when you think about the book of Psalm 107 verse 9, it shows you how God can provide to both those who are hungry and those who are thirsty. Whatever you thirst for today, God is able to give it to you. And whatever you hunger for, God is able to give it to you. And we are living in the... What we're living today is part of a testimony of the prayers that you did yesterday. So when it says, see what the Lord has done, what you prayed for, it has come to pass. Indeed, the prayers of yesterday have been answered and you are living part of what you're living today is part of the prayers you did yesterday. And if what you're living today is undesirable, remember to pray in advance for tomorrow's blessings and the Lord will bless you. See what the Lord has done. What you prayed for, it has come to pass. See what the Lord has done. So look around you and be grateful for what the Lord is doing in your life, what He's doing in your family, what He's doing in your in your career, or whatever aspect of your life. Look and see that the Lord is a good, good Father. God bless you and I'll see you next time.